my friends, let's move on and fill our buckets. This is the last slide that we're going to look at. So our task one is bucketing. We need to put all those wonderful ideas into our buckets. So if you haven't already done that, um, bucket A has a title, B has a title, and C or D, we're not going to use C, but D um, fights dictatorship. So each of these educates their citizens, expands democracy, fights a dictatorship. That's what your buckets need to say, please. And let's move on. And the next thing, if we scroll down halfway through the page, it says thesis development and roadmap. Thesis development and roadmap. Um, they call this uh, little graphic organizer here the chicken foot, and I happen to like the chicken foot. I think it's kind of cool. And a chicken foot will help you write a better essay. So on the chicken foot below, write your thesis and your roadmap. Your thesis should answer the mini Q question. The roadmap is created from your bucket labels and lists the topic areas you will examine in order to prove your thesis. So again, let's remember our um, question, our mini Q question. Why is freedom of the press essential to a democracy? Well, that goes on your thesis line. Then each of your bucket labels go on your chicken toes to form your chicken foot okay so we know that freedom of the press is essential to democracy because it educates citizens expands democracy and fights dictatorship that is going to be um, the whole entire thesis and then um, that is what you will put for your mastery check for this activity i hope you've enjoyed learning about freedom of the press and why it is essential to a democracy. I hope that you've learned something about your country compared to other countries in the world. Um, and if you have questions, contact your social studies teacher or you can contact me either one. I'll be more than happy to talk to you. See you next time.